Richard Akinjide was a legal practitioner that made his mark in the legal profession. Earlier, my colleague Zika Onuma spoke to a senior advocate of Nigeria, Ebun Adeburuwa, on the demise of the legal luminary. Take a listen. He also was very pivotal in the emergence of the legal profession and the standards created. He rose to become the uh, Federal Attorney General, was a member of the Body of Benchers, was the chairman of the Nigerian Bar Association, he was the chairman of the Body of Benchers. He has seen it all. Anything you could wish for anybody in the legal profession in Nigeria, Chief Kinjide has represented him. Even before his death, he was the chairman of the Body of Senior Advocates. That means the oldest member of the Body of Senior Advocates of Nigeria. And you know, you remember that he uh, performed wonderfully uh, during his uh, reign as uh, Federal Attorney General, remembering that landmark case of uh, 12 to 12, where he uh, brought that ingenious argument concerning the 1979 elections. So no doubt, Nigeria has lost a very brilliant mind in the death of Chief Richard Akinjide S.A.N. From what you said earlier, uh, he was in the forefront of the legal profession in Nigeria. Uh, tell us how he influenced uh, the training of legal profession. Well, you know, as the chairman of Body of Ventures, Chief Akinjide was responsible for the training of lawyers, for the discipline of lawyers, and he was also responsible for ensuring that there is strict compliance with professional ethics within the legal profession. And he was a man who never compromised standards. He was very, 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 very neat. If you see him in court, it will be your dream of an ID lawyer, always immaculately dressed, speaking eloquent Queen's English and very brilliant. And he replicated that in virtually all the people that came uh, across with him uh, during his tenure as the Attorney General and Minister of Justice. In that position, he was the chairman of the Bar Council. So he was the leader of the Bar in Nigeria. And you could see that he, both in himself, his daughter, who is a lawyer, and his wife, Chief Mrs. Williams, who is also a senior advocate of Nigeria, he comes across you as a quintessential field lawyer who left indelible marks upon the sands of the legal profession in Nigeria. No doubt we have lost a colossus who will be remembered for pioneering the standard of legal practice to ensure quality and nobility within our legal profession.